All right. So again, welcome, welcome to Core and More. Happy Monday. My name is Eric. Let's get started with that warm up. All right. We're gonna start on the ground. Two exercises, all right? Two exercises. We've done these before. We got dead bugs, all right? So work on that stability, core stability here with a little movement, all right? Some of the opposite arm and leg, extend it, all right? Make sure you really set that belly button towards your spine, glue that core or glue that uh, lower back to the mat, and then we end off with a hollow hold, all right? So we got 30 seconds for each. Then we go jump right to it. Y'all ready? Let's get it in three, two, one. Let's go with those dead bugs here. Opposite arm and leg. Maybe you could just move the legs if you need to. Try to keep that core engaged. Get it nice and warmed up here. Got 15 seconds, then we go right to that hollow hold. Keep it up, keep it up, keep it up. All right, get ready for the hollow hold in three, two, one. All right, let's hold it, let's hold it. Try to bring those shoulders off the ground. Arms overhead or arms to the side. Keeping that core engaged here. 15 seconds. Keep it up, keep it up. Keep working, keep working. We got a couple seconds. Three, two, one. Relax, relax, relax. All right, all right. Let's get right to it. So we go do the same um, kind of format we've been doing the last couple of times, all right? Got five exercises. Each one's gonna be 50 seconds. All right, it'd be 10 second break in between. Uh, for the first round, we go one by one, like we usually do. Um, and then next round, we speed it up a little bit, all right? First exercise, we got some ab walkouts, all right? So a couple options, start in a full plank position. You can walk those hands out as far as you can. Walk it back, keeping that core tight, all right? Next option, remember, drop those knees to the ground, same thing, walk it out and walk it back, all right? If you want to, add some extra work in, add a push-up in in between, all right? Get a little extra core work in with that one. All right, we got 50 seconds. Y'all ready? Three, two, one, let's go. Let's walk it out, just make sure you have control. Walk it back in, Get that push up in. All right. Nice control here, good, good, good. Good work, y'all. Good work. Like those push ups, Tay and Jonathan. Keep it up. I can't see Bill, Mickey, and Linda, but I know they're killing it. Keep work. Keep it up, y'all. Keep it up. We got 15 seconds. 10 seconds. Keep it up here. Keep it up. Keep it up. Couple seconds. Couple seconds. Two, one. All right, right, relax, relax. We're gonna flip it over, flip it over now, right? Got some butterfly sit-ups, all right? So, excuse me, start on our backs. Bring both feet together like we're about to stretch our adductors, all right? So let's go feet filled in the core and then the adductor muscle. Use that core, to bring you up and down slow, all right? Try not to use momentum. Try to use those core muscles, bring you up, down slow. Remember other options, you could do a regular sit-up. That works. Well, all right, so choose which option works best for you. 50 seconds in three, two, one, let's go. Here we go, here we go. Use that core, bring you up, down under control. Nice control here, really work on that. Try not to use that momentum. Should keep breathing. Keep on working hard. All right, we got about 20 seconds. Keep it up, keep it up, keep it up. You got 10 seconds. This last couple reps in. 
Work, work, work. Couple seconds. Two, one. Relax, 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 all right? We're flipping it over again. We're gonna flip it over again, all right? We're gonna try some plank knee taps, all right? So I have a different variation for you today, all right? First variation, the regular plank knee taps or toe taps, using that arm to reach for the opposite knee or toe, back down and alternate, all right? Remember, that's one option. Another option, what you're gonna do is you're gonna stay on one side for this option, all right? So use that right arm, use that toe extension and keep going, all right? So you never drop in that right arm to the ground until the 50 seconds are up, all right? That's how we go work. We just go stay on that one side. If you're doing this option, next round, we we'll switch it up, all right? Remember other options, you can also skin that plank position, add some shoulder taps in if you choose not to do the knee taps, all right? So your choice, Knee tap, knee taps with extension or shoulder taps. We got 30, uh, 50 seconds. In three, two, one, let's go. And push those hips towards the ceiling, keeping that core tight. Keep doing that extension, extend that arm straight in front of that body. A little extra challenge there. Remember, if you need some extra stability, spread those legs out. Spread those feet apart a little bit so you can get some stability there. You definitely feel this in the shoulders and core. They keep on working here. We got about 15 seconds. Work, work through it. We got it, we got it, we got it. 10 seconds. Couple seconds, two. One, all right, relax, relax, relax. All right, all right. We're on our backs again. Go back, back to those windshield wipers, all right? Windshield wipers, remember arms out to the side. Rotate those legs side to side, nice and under control, either legs straight or knees bent, all right? Working at those obliques, just go as far as your mobility allows you to go. Keep those shoulders squared. To the, to the roof or the, the, the ceiling, all right? We got 50 seconds in three, two, one, let's go. Make sure to try to keep those shoulders squared to the ceiling. Just go side to side, nice and under control. Use that core for the movement. Getting some oblique work in here. Keep working, y'all. Keep working. There we go. There we go. Nice under control. Good work. Good work. 15 seconds. Work, work, work. Couple seconds here. Couple seconds. Two. One, relax, 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 all right, all right. Last one, last one before we do it again, all right? We're gonna get in a bear crawl position, all right? Two options, first option, all right? Keep those knees hovered over the ground. We have some kick throughs and toe taps, all right? So you're rotating through, using that right arm to reach for that right leg, sorry, that left leg and that left arm, reaching for that right leg, all right, so nice. Control rotation here, kick throughs. Other options, stay in that bare car position, add that toe tap or knee tap, all right? All right, so a couple options there. Choose which one works best for you. We got 50 seconds in three, two, one, let's go. We'll be kicking through. Nice and under control here. Nice work. Try to really extend that leg as you rotate, All right? Keep working, y'all, keep working. We got 20 seconds. Keep it up, keep it up, keep it up. Less than 10 seconds. 
Couple seconds. Two. One. All right, relax, relax. Good work, y'all. Good work, good work. Feeling good? All right. Round one done. We got round two coming up in about 30 seconds. Get some water. We can start from the top. Ab walkouts, butterfly sit-ups. Working way down, all right? Remember, it's shorter breaks this time. Move a little bit quicker, all right? 10 seconds. If you want to, in between exercises, you can do a place hold, a plank hold, hollow hold. It's up to you. Uh, I'll give you a time to count down before we have to switch to the next exercise if you choose to do that, all right? Let's get ready, y'all. Remember, back to those ab workouts. We got 10 seconds. Get it set up. Keep on your knees or a full plank position. Everybody ready? In three, two, one. Let's go. Walking it out, walking it back in. Nice under control as far as you can. All right. Without letting that lower, those hips drop or laying that lower back. Arch in, keeping that core engaged. Keep on working. All right, all right, all right. We got about 20 seconds, y'all. Keep it up, keep it up, keep it up. 10 seconds. Work through it, work through it. Three, two, one, all right, all right. You can hold a plank if you want to. If you want to, you can hold a plank. We got butterfly sit-ups coming up. Get ready. In three, two, one, let's go. All right to those butterfly sit-ups. Now core engaged. Sitting up. Good work, y'all. Good work. I like that set the press Terry's doing. That dumbbell looking good, looking good. There we go, Linda, keep it up. See Mickey hands. Good work, y'all, good work, good work, keep it up. There we go, Bill and Jonathan, nice control there. Keep going, y'all, keep going. We got 15 seconds. All right, all right, all right, less than 10. We're getting closer, a couple seconds. You can do a hollow hold if you want to. Three, two, one. All right, if you want to do a hollow hold real quick, we got those plank knee taps or plank knee tap extensions in three, two, one. Let's go. Remember, if you're doing a knee tap extension, switch legs. Stay on that opposite arm. So if you did the right arm that last time, go into that left. You're doing regular knee taps. Keep alternating with that one. Keep on working. Good, good, good. All right, 15, uh, 25 seconds, sorry. 25 seconds. Work here. We got y'all. Maybe you can also do plank shoulder taps. Just keep working. You got 15 seconds. Push it, push it, push it. Less than 10. Windshield wipe is coming up. Three, two, one. You can hold that plank if you want to. You can hold that plank. We got windshield wipers coming up. Get ready for that. And four, three, two, one. Let's go. Right to those windshield wipers. Nice twist there. Good, good, good. Good control, y'all. Keep it up, keep it up, keep it up. There we go, here we go. 25 seconds. I like it, I like it, I like it. Keep it up, keep it up, keep it up. We got 10 seconds, 10 seconds. We got bear crawl kick throughs to end it off. In three, two, one. You can do another hollow hold if you want, or you can switch it over. Bear crawl kick throughs coming up. 
in four, three, two, one. Let's go. And we also bear crow toe, bear crow toe taps work. All right, so bear crow toe taps or knee taps work. Or even though shoulder taps, pick which option works best. Working that core here. Let's do it. Let's do it. Make sure you get some good rotation with those kick throughs. We try to keep that leg through and tap those toes. All right. 30, uh, 20 seconds, 20 seconds. We got it, y'all. We got it. Couple of seconds here, couple of seconds. Three, two, one. Relax, relax, relax. All right, y'all, all right. Catch your, catch your breath, catch your breath. We'll do it one more time. We're going to cut down the time to 40 seconds, all right? Cut down the time to 40 seconds. All right, last round we're doing this. We'll do this for the last round. Then we got a three-minute and wrap, and we're done, all right? Still with me, y'all? Y'all not tired? Come on. We can do this last round. Let's get it. All right, all right. Get some water real quick. All right. So remember, everything's 40 seconds. Back at the top. Got those ab walkouts, all right? So no, no break in between. We just go keep moving through each exercise, all right? I'll count you down with that one. So start with those ab walkouts. We got 40 seconds. And three, two, one. Let's go. Walk it out here and walk it back in. Good work, good work, good work. 20 seconds. Here we go. Maybe we got that push up in with those walkouts. A little extra work there. Let's keep working hard. 10 seconds. Got those butterfly sit-ups coming up. You ready? Three, two, one. All right, flip it over. Butterfly sit-ups. And go. Control, make this the best round. There we go, there we go, there we go. 20 seconds. Good, good, good. Everyone's killing it. Keep it up here, keep it up. We got 10 seconds. All right, for the next exercise, just do plank knee taps, or you can alternate plank knee tap extensions in two, one. All right, all right, plank knee taps or plank knee tap extensions, and go. If you want to do half and half, I'll let you know when 20 seconds are here, or 20 seconds are up. And you can switch it up there if you're doing the extensions, all right? Just keep working, keep working. All right, if you're doing the extension, switch it up, switch it up. With the arms, keep working here, keep working. There we go, there we go. We got about 10 seconds here. That's how we're doing these, make it the best one. Keep it up, keep it up. Couple seconds, three, two, one. All right, windshield wipers, wipers, wipers. And three, two, one, let's go. There we go, good control, y'all. See those legs moving. Keep it up, keep it up. There we go, 20 seconds here, 20 seconds. That's it, and we end off with those bear crawl kick throughs. Good work, good work, good work, 10 seconds. Two, one, all right, last one, bear crawl kick throughs or bear crawl knee taps, toe taps, and go. Last one for the round. Finish this off with a high note. 
Just to round off on a high note here. Got that rotation in. Good work, good work, good work. About 15 seconds left. There we go, there we go. Push, push, push. We got 10, a uh, couple seconds, couple seconds. Three, two, one. Catch your breath, catch your breath, all right? Three minute and wrap and we out of here, all right? Three exercises, all right? We got some knee tucks. We start with some knee tucks. So remember plank position, jump those knees in, jump it back out. If you want to, just jump it in one leg at a time, all right? We got eight reps with those, all right? Eight reps. Next, we go flip it over. We got 10 toe crunches, all right? So legs in the air, reaching for those toes, a nice under control, keep that core tight. 10 of those, remember other options, knees bent or legs on the ground, reaching for the sky, all right? So 10 toe crunches and then a 10 second hollow hold, all right? So count to 10 with that one and do it again, all right? We got three minutes. Let me set the timer here. Start with those knee tucks. We got eight, eight knee tucks in three, two, one. Let's go. Eight knee tucks here. Then we got 10 toe crunches. And end off with that 10 second hollow hold. There we go, there we go. Keep working here. We got that 10 second hollow hold, count to 10. And do it again. Let's see how many rounds we can get in with this last one, all right? Try to get three rounds, three to four rounds in if you can. Or even five. Really push yourself here. Here we go. All right, almost one minute down. Keep working here, keep working. All right, a minute down, a minute down. Everybody's looking like they're at a good pace here. Everybody looks like they're about on their second to third round here. Almost the third round, good work, good work, good work. Keep it up, keep it up, keep it up. Almost halfway there. Here we go, Jonathan, keep it up. Good work, Terry. Here we go, Mickey. Good work, Linda, keep pushing. Here we go, Bill, keep pushing, keep pushing. We got halfway there. Almost there, y'all, almost there. Let's try to aim for those four rounds. Everybody's looking like they go get that or even more. Good, good, good. Nice control, just make sure you have control. Using that core for all the movements. Really work here. We got a minute, one minute. Finish strong. We go and get a nice stretch in and we all done here. So keep working for the next 45 seconds. Work as hard as you can. And we can relax. Good, good, good. Almost at the 30 second mark. Thirty seconds here. Thirty seconds. That's it. Get those last couple of reps in. Work, work, work. There we go. There we go. Fifteen. Come on, y'all. Come on. Get those last couple of reps in. Keep pushing. You better get a break after this. This is it. Countdown, countdown. Five, four, three, two, one. And relax. There we go. Good work, y'all. Good work, good work. Let's stretch it. Let's stretch it out. We can start on our backs. We can start on our backs. All right. Start with both knees towards our, our chest. Okay. Give your back a little massage here. Back in side to side, nice and gently. Whew. Some nice deep breaths in. We now heart rate back down. Mm. 
There you go. Good work. Good work. All right. From here, we just go go right into a butterfly stretch, so we can drop our legs to the floor, stay on our backs, stretch out the adductors here and the thighs. Keep holding, keep holding. All right, you can bring both legs together, extend that left leg out, bringing that right knee towards your chest. Okay, good stretch here. You can bring it towards your chest or even slightly across the body. Get a nice good stretch in those glutes. And hold it here a couple seconds. Right before we switch, we're just going to twist that leg, right leg to the left side, open up to the right, get a nice good spinal twist here. Keeping that chest square towards the ceiling. All right, slowly release. And we're going to switch sides. So extend that right leg out, bring that left knee up. We're going to stretch out the glutes here. So bring it towards that chest. And hold it here about 10 more seconds. All right, then slowly twist that right leg. Oh, sorry, left leg to the right side, open up to the left. All right, we slowly bring it back up. Next, we go right into a happy baby pose. So you can bring those legs up, you can bend those knees, you can grab the outside of those feet, rock side to side, stretch out, come back, inner thighs, hips, good hip opener here. Over here, a couple seconds. Three, two, one. All right, let me go extend those legs in front of us. We're gonna roll up, reach for our toes, stretch out the hamstrings and calves here. Nice stretch. All right. Relax, relax. You can spread open those legs. You're gonna reach in between. Hold it for a couple seconds here. And start to release there. Keep those legs spread apart. Go use that right hand to kind of reach over for our left arm, just like this. Get a nice good stretch in that lower back. for a couple seconds. Start to release and switch sides, same thing. Left arm reaching for that right leg. All right, slowly release, slowly release. All right, we're gonna do some cat and cow from this position here so you can bend your knees. Place your arms around your knees like this, all right? You're gonna open up, squeeze our shoulder blades together, open up that chest, drop those shoulders, and then slowly release. Open up those shoulder blades, squeeze that chest, drop back. Go try it one more time. Move in, open up that chest. And release, breathe out, exhale. Hold it here, hold it here. And slowly release, slowly release. All right, we end off with these next two moves here. Start with the child's pose, All right? So flip it over, pushing those hips back, stretching out those shoulders here. Spread those legs out as far as you need to. 
Drop that forehead to the ground. Nice deep breaths. All right, then bring it forward to an upward dog, cobra, dropping those hips over the leg chest. All right, slowly release from there and begin a plank position. We will do that, some of the greatest stretch, a portion of that, all right? So we go bring that right leg to the outside of our right arm and we can drop that left knee back or keep it in the air. Use that right arm to open up and thread that needle. Try this a couple of times here. Try it one more time. And before you switch sides, keep that right leg up. You're gonna drop that left knee down and use that left arm to open up and drop it back to the floor. Try this a couple of times here. Nice and gentle. Open up one more time and relax, switch sides. Same thing, bring that left leg up. Using that left arm to open up, thread that needle. Open up, thread that needle. Try it one more time. And then drop that left arm to the ground, left right knee back, open up with that right arm. Drop it down, open up, inhale, exhale, one more time. Inhale, exhale, and drop it all the way back. It comes to standing position. He's gonna reach for our toes and roll up one vertebrae at a time to end it off. Come up, roll up, nice and gentle. All the way to the top. Inhale, exhale, take it all out. We're through, y'all. How we do?